Hey guys, Joshua here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Streetcom BC1 Open Bench Table. Assembling the Streetcom BC1 Open Bench Table is really simple. Just line up the legs with the holes with a larger groove on the top, screw them together, and you're done with setup. It did take me a little while longer because when it is a one-person job, it becomes a bit harder to hold in place while lining up the holes. The thing I really like about this bench table is that all the screws, attachments, standoffs that you need are actually fastened to the BC1 already. There are some standoffs on the legs, so screws on the side, stabilizers located on the underside, which brings me to my next point that they've kept a very clean look on this. The storage spaces are all located on the bottom and the screws are then tightened to keep them in place, which makes the BC1 look legit clean. There are also anti-slip grips on the feet, so you don't have to worry about it slipping around when you work on it. So yeah, this is really very very nice. For setups, the PSU goes on the bottom between the legs and you must secure this firmly before usage. After that, you can do whatever you like installing the 3.5 inch and 2.5 inch drives on the bottom also, so it's kept out of the way. Installing your motherboard, which the BC1 supports ATX, MATX and MITX. The long screws are for the PCI, so it's there to hold it in place and there are four provided which can then be used individually or in pairs for the different width cards because you have some that are thicker, some that are thinner and there are also side brackets for fixing radiators and fans from 120mm, 140mm and 240mm. Overall, I think that the Streetcom BC1 open bench table has managed to actually cover all the bases that a test bench requires while looking very clean and very sleek. I look forward to testing it out because I haven't actually been able to easily show and test the different GPUs, coolers that I've actually gotten just because I literally just got this thing. But I look forward to more videos because I will be doing a lot more testing since I've purchased this and yeah, it will be interesting to see like with an open bench table, it's a lot better to test just because if you're in a case, there might be things like airflow that affecting the temperatures and also you can't really see certain aspects of the PC if you put it in a case. So with an open bench table, hopefully I can show you all a lot more like backplate designs, cooler, how the fans work, things like that. So yeah, remember to like and subscribe for more tech and gaming videos, hit the notification bell to get notified when new videos come up and I'll catch you in the next one. Ciao!